Most importantly, of course, we've had ever-recurring cuts to various municipal programs as the, as the city has tried to reduce trim its expenditures because it now has so much that it's liable for. I think the city needs to more aggressively identify a range of new revenue streams that would make a difference in terms of the funding that municipalities had. And since any requests for new funding sources are going to need provincial approval, mm -hmm. they're going to have to think about what will be palatable to the, whether they like it or not, they've got to think of what's going to be palatable for the province. which is <laughs> tweaking the property tax so that it could be rendered less regressive and maybe even progressive uh, and would therefore raise a huge, huge whack of money. And so to, just to scope that in for a moment, by far the largest source of municipal revenue generation is the property tax, real estate. Mm -hmm. I think it's important for this, the city needs to capture its fair share of the value of private wealth that has been generated by the increase in property values in Toronto, which inevitably is connected to the livability of the city.